Hey everyone, it's me, Death by Warner Bros. here to start maybe a new series for my uh, YouTube channel. Um, uh, as some of you probably know, I'm a pretty adventurous eater, and uh, I figure. And I had uh, some clam strips today from uh, this little seafood place in town, and uh, it came with a side of coleslaw. I can't stand coleslaw. I don't think I've. I think I tried it once, and I've never had it since. So. Yeah, you know, the theme of this uh, this series, if I continue it, uh, it'll just be me eating foods that I don't like and trying to finish them. So, here we go. Uh, container of coleslaw. The rules are, just finish it. And and if you puke, uh, like uh, reckless eating, you fail. So, I don't think this will make me puke, but um, it may take me a little while to finish it. So, here we go. Uh, thing of coleslaw. I don't know what it is with coleslaw, it's just, it's really not that bad. I think it's more like a texture thing. Yeah, this is, I don't know if you can see it, this, this kind of, kind of runny. I think this is mayo that's mixed into it. I mean, it's just vegetables, but for whatever reason, I've never liked it. While I'm doing this, might as well look it look it up and find out what's usually in it. Cold slaw. From Wikipedia. Coleslaw, sometimes simply called slaw in some American dialects, is a salad consisting primarily of shredded raw cabbage, which is dressed with buttermilk and mayonnaise. It may also include shredded carrots and other fruits and vegetables, apples, onions, radishes, peppers, as, as well as horseradish and various spices. The term coleslaw arose in the 18th century as an Angla something gestic of the Dutch term coleslaw, a shortening of cool salad, which means cabbage salad. It is originally from Ireland. Well, that's cool. And was made at the end of the month from leftover vegetables and cream. Hey, you learn something new every day. I mean, this isn't that bad. I just, I don't know. I guess I tried it one time and I never really liked it. Because like I said, it has a strange texture to it. But, you know, it's not that bad. I didn't know it. And I never knew it was from Ireland. So yeah. It's pretty obvious I'm not going to puke from the... Excuse me. No, I'm just kidding. Anyway, um... Well, this is... Hey, you learn something new every day and you find something that you like every day. I kind of like this. It's really not that bad. There's uh, another thing from like Ireland that I had on St. Patrick's Day. I forget what it's called off the top of my head, but it, it had cabbage in it. And it was, um, it was kind of like potatoes, but like with cabbage mixed into it. I forget what that was called, but I really liked it. And it's just a shame that they only have it on St. Patrick's Day at Wegmans because, uh, it was really good stuff. Like, I, when I, I got it, because, you know, it was set up like buffet style at Wegmans, because they have a buffet there. I thought it was some kind of pudding, actually. And, um, it wasn't until I got home and I looked it up that I found out that it had cabbage in it. And it was really good stuff. 
it was like kind of like cabbage potatoes, mashed potatoes and with cabbage, I guess. I just can't remember off the top of my head what that was. Oh. Oh. Look at that. Sorry for talking with my mouth full. Ireland. Wait, Saint Patrick's Day food. Let's see if it's listed. Colcannon, that's what it was called. It was called Colcannon. That's an interesting name. It's kind of interesting that they add buttermilk and mayonnaise to this. I mean, I know for a fact that if I ever have buttermilk on the show, I probably, if I drank like a whole thing, I might actually puke from that because I've drank buttermilk before and it was disgusting. Yeah, that's that's something that I could consider for a future episode. There's a hot dog place that my uh, my family likes to go to up in the Poconos called Hot Dog Johnny's. So if we're off that way, I'll make a video of me drinking buttermilk. This is surprisingly good. I'm glad that I made this little video and gave this another try. All I gotta do now is drink the buttermilk mayo. Ugh. Okay, that was a bit much. But, I finished it. So yeah, that's the first uh, episode of uh, eating food that I don't like, so... Look for more in the future sometime. Like I said, if I'm ever up at Hot Dog Johnny's, I'll definitely do a video of me trying to drink a whole thing of buttermilk. So, uh, well, not a whole thing. It'll be like a whole like cup of buttermilk or whatever. Or how, whatever they serve it up there. I think they, I think they actually serve in these like these fancy gl looking glasses. So, if I'm ever up that way, I'll I'll definitely do that video and try and drink a whole thing of it because I remember drinking it as a kid and I hated it. So, yeah. Like I said, uh, coleslaw, it's, it's not bad. So if you're Irish or if you're not Irish, give it a try. It's, if you like salad, it's surprisingly very good. And if you can get over the texture, which I think was my problem, it's really not that bad for like a side dish. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's it for now. Uh, take care, everybody. Bye-bye.